Betty Fisher. Oh, they were just the most darling pair. Always arm in arm whenever I saw them. And he's just so handsome. A real Cary Grant sort of fella. Anyway, Doris the deer, she must have been baking up a storm because she asked to borrow all my baking soda, and I mean all of it. Didn't even bring the box back. Oh, but I don't mind. If I had a hubby as handsome as hers, I'd bake him anything he wants. Denise Brooks. Um, the Del Rios. I should have called them the Benny Goodman Philharmonic with all the noise they made. Screaming, yelling, laughing sometimes. Other sounds, if you know what I mean. All hours of day and night. Anyway, I don't know why she came to me, but luckily for her, I was feeling generous, so I asked what she needed. And you know what she said? Bleach and detergent. Now why she couldn't ask her husband to pick some up from the store, I couldn't tell you. I suppose she must have wanted to wet her frocks nice and clean before the dog came home. Eugene Waters. Really, I hardly knew either of them. Though the man was always at work and I only passed her once or twice on the stairs. I live at the other end of the hall, so I never heard anything from them. Would be hard to anyway over that cacophony Denise Brooks is always playing. Anyway, as you can imagine, I was quite surprised when she came to my door, asking to borrow no less than three bars of soap, a hacksaw, and, if you can believe it, every rubbish bag I had. Sorry, a garbage bag. Anyway, yeah, I told her she could keep the soaps, but she must have had a hell of a lot to throw out, because I didn't get one of the bags back, and the hacksaw was blunt as a butter knife. Doris Del Rio. I know this may sound excessive, but my husband travels a lot. And whenever I get to spend a few days with him, I want the house to look the best it's ever looked. He's a very particular man, to say the least. He likes his food on the table and his house clean. So I tend to do exactly that to make him happy. So I borrowed some stuff from the neighbors, some Baking and cleaning supplies to make everything neat. The floors, the windows, laundry, food. You know, a little spring cleaning too. <laughs> and I, of course, trimmed his beloved plant that he got from his boss, a caladium tree. Simply lovely. I was expecting to find him coming through the door later that day, but... <clears throat> Yeah. Okay. Goodness. Please have some. I made plenty.